displayed there had the power to soothe her soul. And even the guard at the door wouldn't let her pass. She was content to just stand outside and stare. She recalled a glass angel in the window once, a powerful figure. The angel's long hair was swept back like holy glittering fire, and her wings were about to unfold from a strong, sleek body. After the girl left, the Nukaba rubbed her thigh in evident anguish. Tia saw what she guessed was a musket ball scar, months old but still red and angry. 45. 45. Now here's 21. Just listen. 21. 21. Repítelo. Repeat it. Repítelo. 20. Do you have any suggestions? I don't think you'll find it very appealing. Try me, Delinar said. I'm starting to appreciate that the way I usually do things has severe limitations. 60. Winds and Olds. I worry about my fellow Truth Watchers. From drawer 821, Second Emerald. The storm did not belong to Kaladin. He claimed the skies and to an extent the winds. High storms were something different, like a country in which he was a visiting dignitary. He retained some measure of respect, but he also lacked real authority. While fighting the assassin in white, Kaladin had traveled with the high storm by flying at the very front of the storm wall, like a leaf caught in a wave. That method, with the full force of the high storm raging at his feet, seemed far too risky to use when bringing others. He was the only being in the world that I loved. Why was I doing this? The scent of pine needles penetrated my thoughts, and everything seemed clean and fresh. It brought tears to my eyes and power As we approached the building, it didn't get...
Police reported ahead. Radio Los Santos. 